It is time to up your backcountry oatmeal breakfast game. And in this video, I'm sharing with you three delicious and epic oatmeal recipes that you can prepare at home and then bring with you out on the trails. So ditch those boring packets full of sugar and artificial flavors and give one of these a try. All right, so first up is a tropical pineapple coconut oatmeal recipe. You're gonna need plain instant rolled oats, which I usually get from the bulk section, individual coconut oil packets, dried pineapple, toasted coconut chips, and freeze-dried bananas. Start with the oatmeal. I usually do about a half a cup per serving and just put that in a little plastic baggie. Add a handful of freeze-dried banana slices, a handful of diced dried pineapple, and then take one of your coconut oil packets, leave it all packaged up like that and put it into your baggie. And then take another baggie and put a handful of those toasted coconut chips in there. I'm using a little reusable bag here. And then put the coconut chip baggie into the original bag. Seal that all up and you are good to hit the trails. Now, once you're at camp, take out those coconut chips and the coconut oil packet, put those aside, and then pour the rest into your bowl. Get your water boiling, and when you're ready, pour it into the bowl with the oats. And I really like my oatmeal on the thicker side here, so I kind of just guesstimate the amount of water, starting with a little bit and adding more if I need to. And the water will help hydrate those bananas and they'll kind of break apart and make it a little bit sweet. Just mix this up until it's nice and creamy. And then you're gonna open your coconut oil and add that into the bowl and the hot water will actually help melt the coconut oil. And so just keep mixing all of this up until it's melted and the oatmeal will turn super, super creamy. And then once you're there, take your toasted coconut chips and you'll just put those on top and this is just a nice little crunch that really takes this oatmeal to the next level. So there you have it, a nice, oatmeal with tropical vibes. Next up, we have a dark chocolate peanut butter banana oatmeal recipe. To start off, we're gonna have those same plain rolled oats, some chia seeds, freeze dried banana slices, a packet of RX nut butter peanut butter, and a little bit of cocoa powder. Again, starting with the oats, scoop about a half a cup into your baggie. Next, add in a teaspoon of good quality cocoa powder. This makes it nice and rich and dark chocolatey. And then a teaspoon of chia seeds, a handful of those freeze dried banana slices, and then put your nut butter packet into the baggie, seal it up and hit the trails. All right, so once you're at camp, take out the nut butter packet and put that aside and then pour the rest of your bag into a bowl. Pour some hot water over that and give it a good mix. Adding more water if you need to. Some people like their oatmeal a little bit thicker like I do and some people like it a little thinner. So go with what you like. That's the great thing about this. It's super customizable. It will look really creamy and then knead your peanut butter packet and drizzle that on top. I tried to make this look like really spectacular here, but the drizzle did not work as well as I was thinking. <laughs> just get that peanut butter in there and then give it another really good mix. And this one is just so creamy and delicious. If you like the combo of peanut butter and chocolate, I think you're gonna love this one. All right, so next up is a vanilla almond berry oatmeal recipe. Here's what you're gonna need. Plain, instant oatmeal, freeze-dried blueberries, freeze-dried strawberries, a packet of the RX nut butter in the vanilla almond butter flavor, and some slivered almonds. Start with a half a cup of your rolled oats. Add in a handful of freeze-dried blueberries, a handful of freeze-dried strawberries. Oh, I lost one there. <laughs> Add in a handful of those slivered almonds. And lastly, your nut butter packets. Seal that up and you're ready to go. 
All right, so at camp, take out your nut butter packet and put that aside. And then pour the rest of your baggie into a bowl. Add in your hot water and just mix that up, adding more water as you need to. As you can see here, I've actually had to add in water a couple more times to get it to the thickness that I usually like with my oatmeal. Once everything is rehydrated, add in the nut butter. And for this recipe, you really wanna try and find this specific one because this is where like the vanilla flavor really comes from. I'll link to it in the description below. And it's just so decadent and delicious. Like all the other ones, this one is super, super creamy and filling. It will give you tons of energy for your adventures. So there you have it. These are three epic, delicious, and unique oatmeal recipes for your next backpacking adventure. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Make sure to subscribe.